All right, so we got a real interesting piece of rail equipment here, <clears throat> maintenance of way equipment. Um, it's from the Low Ram Company, who does a lot of uh, specialized rail grinding and other things for pretty much anybody, any rail operation across the country. But um, this thing here is a ballast cleaner. Now, ballast is pretty much anything that the rail tracks sit upon. So if you look down there, you see there's all types of stone. Um, sometimes it's a lot more elevated than others. This one here is pretty ground level, but um, apparently it needs to be clean. And what that means is water and uh, other debris like that get trapped in the actual rail bed. And when freezing temperatures come along, you get frost heaves and it pushes the tracks out of alignment and you know you get derailments and all types of good stuff like that so this thing is designed to help alleviate that so you see that big spinning wheel <clears throat> that goes along and it digs along the uh, shoulder or the ballast and it removes material which helps the water to actually seep out it dumps it into this hopper conveyor system which goes ahead and begins shaking and sorting out items or rocks based on the size. Some of them shoot down the side here. Others continue on their way. Um, the ones that fall back down and are the right size, they get sort of pushed back into place, leveled out, graded, while the rest of the material continues along through more screeners and cleaners. It's all types of hydraulic lines, belts, hoppers, shakers. at least three or four different power plants for this unit. Some other type of hopper. See like brushes there, clean and level everything off. It's a huge, gigantic contraption. One that I've never seen running before. So, um, the story is that the ballast or the sizes of racks that don't meet the specifications, they can either be shot into this hopper here, which has wheat and dirt growing out of it, so uh, I don't think it gets used all that much, or they angle this final belt off here to the side and they just shoot it off, uh, off into the weeds basically. Around these parts, um, you know, the rail lines cut through a lot of developed areas and, uh, you know, sidings where you have businesses and other things. So I don't think they can really just throw the uh, used material right off into the weeds without smashing the, you know, other property, other trains, things like that. So that's the basic idea. As far as I understand it, I had to go to the lower end website and check it out. But uh, back here we have some type of water tank. We got the crew bathroom. There's uh, a lot of maintenance and engineering type stuff in this final car here. Um, have not seen this run like I mentioned. I did see it the other night, idling on a set of tracks, and it is loud. Um, don't know if they do this at nighttime over the daytime, but it'd be cool to catch it. So there you have it, a low ram ballast cleaner. Hopefully I'm saying the name of the company right. I think so. So, any questions, comments, feel free to drop a line and let me know. Thanks for watching.